Hey, what's up, everybody? We are on the United States Mint 2022 product schedule, but we have a little bit of new information that I want to share with you. And this I learned in the comment section of my video this morning from Juice. Left a comment in my video this morning. See, it's not always me providing new information to you. Sometimes I learn some valuable information just by reading the comments in my comment section. I do read every comment that you place in my comment section and sometimes it's brand new information that I did not know and this is one of them. The next release on August the 16th, 2022, the American Women Quarter Rolls and Bags Nina Ontario Warren has new limits let's go take a look we are looking at the enrollments and this is for the next release in the american women quarter series and by far in my opinion the most popular the p the d and the s are enrollments for the last one which was wilma Mankiller, was reduced from five to four so sally ride was reduced down to five the wilma Mankiller was reduced from five to four well our new limits for the P, D, and the S was reduced from four to three. So we have now a household order limit of three and it's showing enrollments, household order limit of three. The next question is, well, where are the remaining gonna be going? Are they gonna be available on drop day? Last drop day was kind of weird because everything was gone within like two to three seconds but we have been reduced on the enrollment side down to three. It will be really interesting to see if they have any available on actual drop day. So that is the P, the D, and the S. And then the P and D rolls was also reduced down to three. And then the 100 coin bags, you have a household order limit of 10 and I can't remember was it 10 last time I did not order any of them so I'm not sure if those were 10 or not let me know in the comment section down below but both of the bags have a household order limit for the enrollments of 10 now the product schedule is not populated with anything on here so it's not telling us if there's an actual limit for drop day but then again who knows if there's going to be any available on drop day to begin with now the other thing that i wanted to bring up also was the product limit because if you look at the pd and s rolls it's showing on the enrollment page a product limit of 7504 and that's the same thing that it showed for the Wilma Mankiller, I had a product limit of 7,504 for the enrollment, but when it came to the actual listing on the product schedule, then it had a product limit of 7,620. So I'm assuming it's gonna probably be the same, even though we're seeing a lower product limit on the enrollment page, we are going to probably see once everything is populated on the product schedule we're probably going to see a product limit of 7620 but of course this is not going to be coming out until august it's going to probably be a couple of weeks yet until we're able to see everything that we want to see on here but as of right now we have very little to no information except for we do know that the release date of this is august 16th 2022 however is there going to be anything available for the p d and s we should have probably a very little quantity for the p bags the d bags and the p and d rolls but enrollment numbers were decreased as far as how many you're going to be able to purchase on enrollment but it'll be very interesting to see if we're going to have anything available on drop day for the p the d and the s i should clarify by saying it looks like our enrollments are going to be reduced for the p d and s rows to three based on what this page here is saying that the household order limits for the enrollments for the p d and s is three however since i cannot see my actual enrollments because the web page appears to not be working properly where it shows that i have zero enrollments the page is showing blank so i cannot confirm that my enrollments was actually reduced to three until the my enrollment part of the website starts working again but if you can see your enrollments and if you had four for the Wilma Mankiller PDNS release, let us know in the comments section down below if your PDNS enrollments was cut back from four to three. 
Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. I appreciate everybody for watching. Like, comment, subscribe, share, and I'll talk to everybody on my next video. Thanks a lot, everyone.